Hey, good morning, squad. It's Janice, and welcome back to my channel. Hope that this video finds you all of great, excellent spirits. So, before we jump into this review, I want you to grab a reflective surface. I don't care if it's a good old-fashioned mirror. I don't care if you open up IG and put you through a filter on or Snapchat. You want to put that filter on. doesn't matter as long as you can see yourself. Put it in front of you. Tell yourself you love yourself. Self-love is crucial to being successful in this life. You have got to love yourself. You've got to take care of yourself. If you want to experience happiness, if you want to experience love, if you just want to experience the most out of life, you have got to love yourself. Okay. You got to put yourself first. I'm not saying be selfish. We've talked about this before. It's not about being selfish. It's just about making sure you're taking care of yourself, making sure you're checking in with yourself, especially if you're one of those. I know you've seen the memes about checking in with your strong friends, especially if you're one of those type of people, those type of personalities, you got to check in with yourself. I'm like, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Look, I know you've done all this on your list, but I need you to stop. And how are you doing? How are you doing? You got to do this for yourself and you got to tell yourself you love yourself. Through the good times, through the bad times, through the thick and the thin, tell yourself you love yourself. Congratulate yourself. You are your own best cheerleader because you know yourself like nobody else. Nobody knows you like you know you, okay? So when you achieve something, whether it's really, really small, really, really big, in the middle, doesn't matter what it is. Congratulate yourself. Cheer yourself for it. Keep on going. If you're having a good day, if you didn't snap at anybody, if you didn't strangle your kids, tell yourself, gold star, good job. The kids survived. You survived. Everybody's good. Congratulations. <laughs> Anything like that. Just congratulate yourself. Motivate yourself. Encourage yourself. There's so many resources out there to uh, give yourself self-love, to do your affirmations, to just do the basics of I love you and keep going like you got this okay so take a second to do that pause the video go take care of that come right back unpause and play and let's get into this review so if you're new to my channel I like to do motivational things and inspirational things at the beginning of the video I like to feed your soul because once this is fed once this feels good once your soul's taken care of once you're like truly happy you're just beautiful it radiates outwards and all of this is just accessories to a beautiful soul, okay? So that's why I like to do those messages. If you don't like to hear them, you can always skip forward. That's the great thing about technology. You can fast forward. We've always had that even since the days of VCRs, okay? So you can fast forward. It's fine. You won't hurt my feelings. Someone's going to hear my message, and as long as it resonates with one person, that's that's all I can ask for. That, that's what I'm shooting for. Okay, so we have a review we're going to review the unit that i'm currently rocking on my head right now okay outre outre however you pronounce this perfect hairline this is ivona ivana ivona how you want to pronounce her hopefully you can see i'm in my other bathroom try to set my ring light so i hope this is coming across with great lighting because i just i'm lazy and i don't feel like setting up everything else anywho so Part of perfect hairline, we should all be familiar with this. 13 by six, transparent lace, no plectum required, heat resistance up to 400, baby hairs included, and guys, no full scalp. They didn't put full scalp in this one. Thank you, Altra H, for listening to us and not putting that crap in there. One less thing we gotta worry about when we're trying to customize these units and put them on our heads, okay? So uh, the color that I was trying to get and I finally got is DRFF Ginger Mahogany. I have not tried this color. Out of my favorites, Cajun Spice is my absolute favorite. Um, I like cream soda. That one was pretty cool. I didn't want cream soda in this unit. Um, and I still never uploaded the other unit I reviewed in cream soda. But I like cream soda. Anywho, I wanted to try this one to see the color because the color looks so gorgeous on the phone and it's gorgeous in person. I don't know if this is coming off on camera. I should have taken pictures in the light. I completely forgot uh, when I was on my way to work. But uh, this is gorgeous. Like it's, let's see what colors we have here. We have like an orange going through here with like a uh, light, uh, that yellow orange going through there. There's some amber pieces going through here. And then you have like, I would consider this like a four. No, not, yeah, like a four, maybe a six going through here. 
but definitely like a, a beautiful kind of light chocolate brown that's going on through here. Not any 1B or anything like that, but just more on the, the lighter shades of brown. Um, like a beautiful mahogany color. Like the mahogany I kind of get like in this area right here, but it's this is a gorgeous color. Like it's almost like Cajun spice, but Cajun spice is more on the red orangey side. And to me, maho ginger mahogany is more on the yellow orangey side, if that makes sense. But uh, th this color is gorgeous gorgeous like this is a gorgeous color the little highlights right here in the front Ugh, gorgeous okay i probably already put it up if i haven't put it up i'll put the video of me unboxing her um did i keep the lace i think did i keep the lace in here okay so i had to dig for the lace here's the lace right here guys do not look at my nails right now they're hor they're horrendous look I'm trying to soak them off. It's taking forever. I didn't have time for that. So, so yeah, they are. It is what it is. Just ignore it. We're gonna move on. Um, the light, the lace is like a light brown, light ashy brown. So you will have to tint the lace. I didn't have to tint the lace uh, too much. Like I didn't put any powder on today at work. But then once I got home, right now, and in front of this ring, these ring lights, you know, the ashy tone is pulling with these types of artificial lights. But like when I was looking in the mirror on my way to work and at work, it didn't look bad. So I don't know, just to be on the safe side, go ahead and tint the lace if you're in my shade. Um, skin tone, just, just to be on the safe side. The cons, as you can see, the hair is like kind of poofy and it was poofier than this. Like it's still, when I parted to the side, it was like this. And I quickly put this on, I put my scarf on and I went to work got to work to take the scarf off because I only put the scarf here and saw this and I was like oh my god it's like oh crap I'm like what am I gonna do I cannot work like this like I could not work with the hair doing this I didn't know what to do I didn't lay this all the sides down so I couldn't do the flip over method I was freaking out because I was I mean I know grand scheme of things not the most important thing in the world but just working in customer service, I just didn't want to work like that. You know, you don't want something that looks bad. You just don't feel good because you're thinking about it and you're thinking the customers are looking at you. They're thinking about it. And you just can't be comfortable. You know, that's just one thing you're worrying about. Um, and no, you shouldn't worry what people think about you. But come on, you still should feel confident in yourself. And just having that piece up there looking crazy, I just, I didn't want to work like that. So anywho luckily I have a curling wand that I leave at the store and so um I plugged it in and I just went through it and just applied some heat to bring it down because the hair it just does something weird and then it it's like that other it's like a uh, charisma the hair some of the hair goes like back instead of like coming straight out and down it goes back so you have to train the hair to lay flat this way um, but once you train it, I mean, it lays pretty flat. This next thing is not really like a true con, just more of a preference. I like these units. I just wish they were a little bit more on the yakky side. You know, this just has a silky texture to it. Um, so like you can see, she she's already eating snacks. Wore her all day. Have I have had her on probably for about, uh, let me, not probably, let me check. So for about, um, for about 10 hours. So I've had her on for about 10, at 10 hours. Um, so yeah, I just would have liked them to just put, incorporate a little bit more of a yakky texture to these units. Um, not as much as like the Julianne units, but just, just a little more, something like kind of in between. Um, I do have some shedding, but I, guys, I cut into this lace nasty, like not good nasty, like bad nasty. I was in a rush like always, and I just wasn't paying attention trying to talk to the kids and I cut into the lace so I'm not sure if she's a true shedder I mean I've been brushing you know I brushed her a few times during the day but I'm just I'm not sure so just be conscious of that it seems like the other ones shed a little bit so just keep that in mind so I think those are the only cons I really have with this unit um going into the pros I mean you already know the colors are pro the hairline's a pro. It lays so flat. It's a pro. Like, you can't tell me nothing. 
in this unit. Even though my nails look funky as crap, you're probably thinking, oh, you care about the way your hair looks, but not that you these fucking funky nails. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. It doesn't. But I don't know. It is what it is. <laughs> like my hair and my makeup, just I want them to be on point. Like I want my nails too, but I don't know how to explain it. Just it doesn't bother me with the nails. I don't care. Parting space is just as good as you would expect with these types of units. Um, so there's the flip over method. And of course, it's a 13 by, is it six or seven? 13 by six. So of course, you know, you can have some fun with her as long as you put her on straight, unlike myself. <laughs> put her on straight, you can have some fun with her. So this is the flip over method with her. Excuse me, guys, I just ate dinner. So yeah, bear with me. But oh, she is so, this, look, look at how this, oh, this color is gorgeous. How did I sleep on this color? Like if they release another unit, which they probably will, I think I will get this color again if, if, they, if it's available. This is just, this is just pretty. This is such a pretty, oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. Look at the way they did the color. I love how it's on the tips, but not like too, like, like high up on the tips, not like just the tip tip, like they... I can go on and on about this color, but it's gorgeous. It's like salon quality color. Like they're, they're like Bobby Bosch. Now Bobby Bosch is really good on colors. They make colors look like they just come out like you, like if this was your hair out of the salon, Altre is doing it with this color here. Like this is a beautiful color blend. Um, she is big head friendly. I didn't, guys, I was in a rush. So I tried to lay this as I could. Um, so I cut me out some, um, Cut me out some sideburns uh, just to lay this lace down because if you do the middle part, then you can cover all this up in this part right here. But if you're wanting to do like the flip over melt, melt melted method, our right side, left side part, and your head, you know, it's about as big as mine 22 and a half, 23 inches. Um, you're gonna have to lay down these sideburns somehow because you're gonna see the lace. It's, it's like it lifts up, not that it doesn't fit, it just lifts up. So, uh, Lay down the sideburns. Even if you don't want to use the baby hairs, just lay down the sideburns so that they're not just showing and doing their thing. All right, guys. So here's my final look uh, for Miss Ivona. Ah, oh, I forgot to show you guys um, the 360. This is her to the back. Sorry, I have her half up, half down. I keep forgetting to do those, the, the, uh, the 360 views. Um, so yeah. She has a great density her density to her. I don't think I said that earlier. Let me know, guys. What do you think of Missy Bona? Are you picking her up? What do you think about the perfect hairlines? Are, are you into them? Or are you over them? Do you feel like they're just releasing too many? They're starting to look the same? Or do, can you see some variety in the units that are available? Um, I Overall, they have definitely come a long way since they first released. And I do like the perfect hairlines. I do kind of look forward to seeing what style that uh, Altre comes out with. And so I think that the one, another reason why I really love this unit besides the color is that it's big head friendly. Like I can, look, I can do a half up, half down. I can, you know, lay the edges down and like, I can do this with my big head. You know what I mean? So I think that's what I'm just so excited for this unit. So, <laughs> all right, guys, let me hop off of here. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this. If you're new to my channel, subscribe. It's free. You don't need a tax refund. You don't need the stimulus that they're still trying to work on. You don't need it. Just hit subscribe, support, please. I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. Let's empower each other to achieve um, our best selves. Uh, hit the button so you get notifications on when a new video is headed your way. And oh, please share my content. I would greatly appreciate that as well. I'm trying to hit 1,000 subscribers so I can do a giveaway uh, for hitting that milestone. So if you can help me out, pay it forward. What goes around comes around. You put out positive, it's going to come back to you. So I would appreciate the support. And yeah, let me hop off of here because I'm about to record another video. All right, guys. Bye.